In this video, we'll be applying gradients to text using Inkscape. So the first thing we we'll need to do is select the text tool and type some text. Once you have some text, I like to click this uh, lock here on the top menu bar so that when you scale it, it won't get stretched in one direction or the other. It just scales up uniformly. Then we'll right click and go down to duplicate because I'm gonna show you a few different methods of applying gradients to this text. The gradient tool is over here on the left menu bar. So we'll click it and with that tool selected, left click and hold and that will create a gradient into transparency. And so on this left side, if we click on this dot here, this square, we can choose a color. We'll choose this dark red. And then the right side has a circle. We'll click on that circle. And when it's selected, we can choose a different shade of red. And that will create a gradient from between those two colors. And we can change this color uh, to adjust it however we want. Let's do this again on the text below. We left click and hold with the gradient tool to drag and create the gradient across. And then now if we double click at any point on this line, we can create a new gradient point. So now we have another point. We can just come in here, keep double clicking, and create as many points as we want because we're going to have a lot of different colors um, changing uh, between these different points. And we can click and drag and adjust these also. And just go ahead and pick some different colors. We can create sort of a rainbow effect. So if you left click and hold on one of these points, you can drag it and choose where the gradient, how far it goes between uh, the two different points. And you can change the entire gradient by just clicking on one end and moving it. So we can even change the direction of the gradient this way. So let's say we want to do a vertical gradient instead of a horizontal gradient. We can just change this and it will scale all these colors that we already have in here um, vertically instead of horizontally. Pretty cool, right? So that's a quick look at how to use gradients in Inkscape. We applied these gradients to text, but you can also do this to any path or object in Inkscape. Hopefully you found this video informative. Go ahead and leave your questions and comments below if you have any, and I look forward to catching you in the next video.